Hey, this is Chuck at ThatRhythmMan.com. I have another acoustic arch top for you today. And um, if you've watched my channel much, you know that acoustic arch tops are kind of one of my favorite subcategories of guitars. Um, and this one is one that I actually hung on to for quite a while for myself. But I have decided to pull this one and make it available. This is a 1946 Epiphone Emperor. This one has actually, until it came to me, had been in the ownership of a single family. Um, and I was very glad to get it. It has had a couple of small repairs, has a couple of small cracks that have been cleated, so they're totally stable, don't affect the sound of the guitar at all. You know, but if you're looking for a perfect guitar, this one's not going to be it. If you are looking for a great sounding one, this could be it. Um, has the original pick guard, original tailpiece here, which some of you may note the bars are reversed. I tend to kind of like it that way, but they're easily switchable. You can go either way with it. Um, it does give you, if you like, to bend strings. <laughs> makes it much easier. These are 12s. They bend pretty easily because of this extra length that you have. And um, I'd like to show you the tuners here because they are original, but you'll see that the A string tuner right there has had the tip replaced and in order to replace it, and they had their luthier recreate one. You know, it's not an exact match, but it does look pretty good and certainly functions well. The tuners work great. Um, everything about the guitar works great. They had it refretted at some point because it's been played a lot. Um, which is, as many of you know, often the sign of a really good guitar. Really nice flamed back and flamed neck with a lot of finish wear, but in really great shape. has a very slight V shape to the neck. Very comfortable. Um, and that's about it for this guitar, I guess. Um, Adirondack spruce top, maple sides and back, the um, seven ply maple and walnut neck. And let's um, give it a little listen. On this one, I have it currently strung with um, Martin Retros, and uh, those are the Manel strings, so they are, you know, kind of um, what a lot of guys were playing back in certainly the 30s and into the 40s. Um, but anyway, let's give it a listen.
Okay, anyway, there you have it, 1946 Epiphone Emperor. I think you can tell probably that it has a very even tone all the way throughout from low to high, which is really nice. It has a nice amount of volume, but it also, you know, sometimes they're known for being really punchy, which this one can do for sure. But it can also, you know, do a pretty good job of Pretty good job of sustaining. It doesn't give it all just in one rush completely. Um, so anyway, there it is. very even across there from A to A, which the, a lot of times that can be pretty tough for a guitar like this. Anyway, 1946 Epiphone Emperor at ThatRhythmMan.com. Thanks for looking.